Okay, I am so excited about today's video. I recently heard about chocolate teas. I don't know if you guys have heard about those yet, but supposedly they are zero calories. There is zero sugar and zero fake sugar in them. They are herbal teas, so they're completely caffeine free. And the most important part is that they're supposed to curb your sugar and your chocolate cravings. Like, hello, if that is really the case, then why aren't we all drinking chocolate teas? So today I'm gonna to test them all out for us. I'm gonna be your little guinea pig and I'm gonna see if these chocolate teas really are that awesome. So let's get started. Are you guys excited to try this out? I am so excited because if this actually curbs my chocolate cravings, guys, my whole life is totally gonna to be changed. Anyone else like a chocolate-aholic out there or a sugar-aholic? Um, if I could get my chocolate fix without the calories, I would seriously be in heaven. So I really am hoping that these work and they do the job. So there are a lot of different flavors. I'm actually gonna link you guys to these below in the YouTube description so you guys can go and grab them and get a deal on them too. I'm gonna to try out all these flavors. We have peppermint chocolate, coconut chocolate, or coconut cocoa, <laughs> caramel vanilla, which actually could be really, really good. And this is kind of like a variety pack. So this one has red velvet chocolate, coconut cocoa, strawberry chocolate, peppermint chocolate, and banana chocolate. I don't really even like bananas, but it might be really good in a tea. So let's try them out. So for example, you'll see in this one, the ingredients are things like natural coconut flavor, cocoa powder, chocolate flavoring. There's no sugar, there's no fake sugar. It's all herbal ingredients. So it really is what they claim, zero sugar, zero calories. So we gotta see if it actually tastes good. All right, guys, they are starting to sift. We've got lots of different flavors. All right, so obviously I knew when I was gonna test these teas out, it's not gonna taste like chocolate milk, it's not gonna taste like hot cocoa, although I wish I could drink stuff like that and have it be zero calories. So the smell, guys, is amazing. Like, oh my gosh, I think this might be like the thing we are gonna be all excited about. So I'm gonna taste them one by one. Um, the instructions actually say to use hot water, but you can also put in like a dash of cream or a dash of like milk. I don't have any cream with me because I'm not a coffee drinker um, or a regular tea drinker, but um, you could totally put in like some cream or get some creamer and it probably would make it amazing. All right, we're gonna start with uh, caramel vanilla and I am going to do a little bit of stir. Like I said, I put in double the amount because I like my taste to be strong, not watered down. Here we go, kind of nervous. <laughs> Well, you can definitely taste it. It's definitely not like any other tea I've ever had in my life. So this is good. You guys can, you can actually smell the caramel when you go to drink it. Now the chocolate flavor isn't really strong, but you can smell it and you can taste a hint of it. So what is it the chocolate's overpowering? However, if I could drink something like this that I wasn't gonna gag down um, and it would curb my chocolate craving for zero calories, I totally would be all over that, wouldn't you guys? And so let's do the peppermint chocolate. Oh, this is not peppermint chocolate. <laughs> this is the coconut. Put that over here, whoops. Um, this is the coconut chocolate. I do not like this one as much. Um, the coconut almost kind of tastes like burnt coconut to me. I don't know, if you guys have tried this before, let me know if it tastes like that to you. Let's do the peppermint chocolate. Doo -doo -doo. I think the pepper one's okay. So, so far, this one is the best one. That's so crazy, guys. I am excited about that. Okay, next one is strawberry chocolate. And I have gotta say, this one, when I smelled it to pour it in, was amazing. And I don't even like chocolate strawberry things. Yeah, it smells like strawberry. It smells like the scratch and sniff stickers. That's what it smells like. Yeah, this one is good too. Oh my gosh. I do not like, I mean, I like chocolate covered strawberries, but I do not like stuff like this that has strawberry chocolate, like strawberry filling or strawberry cakes or anything like that. That one is a good one too. Okay, let's do banana chocolate. I told you guys before, I do not like bananas. But again, these things are surprising me, so who knows? It smells very tropical-ish, very banana. Oh, okay, if you like bananas or like the smell of like being at the beach, 
This one is, this one's pretty dang good. My kids might actually like that one. Awesome, okay, and the last one is our red velvet chocolate. So let's give that one a taste. See if it's good. Eh, I don't really like that one. But if you like red velvet, maybe you would, I don't know. <laughs> All right, so the consensus is I really, really love the caramel vanilla and I really like the strawberry chocolate. Those are really strong teas, they're not watered down. And this one's okay too, the banana chocolate. If you guys want to try these out, they're zero calories. Um, I think I'm going to start drinking this every night before I go to bed because I get chocolate cravings really bad at night before bedtime. So after I put my kids to bed and I've like wound down and I'm in like mommy mode and I want to like take a breather, like the chocolate kicks in. It's like, you need chocolate. You need chocolate. And I like a zombie run to the kitchen and eat some chocolate, right? Which truly derails all of the good eating I've been doing all day long. So if I'm able to drink something like this, to get like um, that smell and that taste in my mouth, I bet I wouldn't need any more chocolate anymore. That, oh, guys, I'm seriously so excited. Okay, so you guys can either grab the tins already or you can buy like a sampler box like this one that has a bunch of them in it. So I'm gonna link you guys to all these products below in the YouTube description. If you guys are, if you guys don't know how to get there, just click the little upside down triangle over here in the corner. It'll pop that open for you if you're on your phone. And if you're on your computer, you guys can just click show more. It'll open that up for you. I will link you to all the flavors. You guys can totally try the flavors you want. I have found these at select grocery stores. I have not seen them at places like Walmart or Target yet. Um, I have seen them at places like Harmon's or other like higher end grocery stores. Um, or you can just buy them online and get them shipped free. Whatever you guys want. But if you guys want to try these out, I totally would recommend it because I think this is gonna be my lifesaver because swimsuit season is coming <laughs> and I need to get a better hold of my chocolate cravings. Will you guys comment below and let me know if you guys like this kind of video where I like test it out and I'm your guinea pig because if so, I would love to do more of these. I know it's not the most fun video to watch. Um, probably me drinking stuff is probably pretty boring, but um, I think it's always awesome to get people's opinions of people hopefully that you trust <laughs> to tell you whether something's good or something's bad and it saves you money, right? If you have someone tell you that something's bad and not to buy it or something's amazing, you should totally buy this. So if you guys like that idea and want me to do more things like this where I'm a guinea pig, comment and let me know too, all right? Okay, bye guys. So Brady just got home from work and he's smelling mm. these. That's the caramel oh, one. <laughs> That's the best one. <laughs> Coconut? Yep. Coconut. Can you tell what it is? <laughs> it's peppermint. Peppermint? Yeah. I know, it smells a little off, huh? Because I actually tried that one it doesn't before. Smell like peppermint. Is that honey? Mm-mm. Oh, no, it's kind of a cough syrup smell. Cough syrup smell. It's strawberry. Chocolate strawberry. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. It actually tastes really good. Chocolate strawberry. Okay. Mmm. That's good, too. You gotta look at me at the camera. You can't, just, you can't see the top of your head the whole time. <gasps> What's that one? Banana. Chocolate banana. banana. Chocolate banana. Yep. Okay. <sighs> you won't get this one. Red velvet. Yes, how'd you know? For reals? Did you cheat? No, I just looked at the red. It oh. looks really red. Oh, yeah. And you said I wouldn't get it. Yeah. <laughs> I hate red velvet. I know, you do. Hmm. What do you? How do they taste? Um, well, that caramel one I think is the best. How long have they been sitting here? They've been sitting here for quite a while since you just got home from work. But it's zero calories and tea? no. Yes, it's tea. It's zero calories and zero sugar, and it's supposed to help crave or curb your cravings for chocolate. Well, don't drink all of them. Why are you chasing all of them now? Do you like the first one? For yeah. tea, it's obviously not gonna it's taste like. To be warm. Well, yeah, it's supposed to be warm. Yeah, it could be warm. It's supposed to curb your cravings. What was this one? Strawberry? Yeah, I thought that one was good too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's the one he likes. Yeah. That was probably would taste better warm. Maybe you should start drinking this every night instead of all your diet cokes. No. That one's good too. Yeah, the banana one. No, I was saying no to the diet coke. I know. I know. <laughs>